Now the first step is to make a right click on the game, go to properties and then enable the steam overlay while in game. So if this is off, turn it on and then launch the game and then check. If it is already on, then you can turn it off and then check. Now the next step is to perform power cycle. So shut down your computer first, just shut down your computer. And once the computer is shut down, unplug the power cable from the computer and then turn off Wi-Fi router. Wait for a few seconds, restart your Wi-Fi router, connect the power cable back to the computer and then restart your computer and then you can check. Next is to switch to different network. So if you have any other network available, uh, you can switch to different network and then you can check. If that does not work, once you're connected to different network, you can check. If that does not work, you can use mobile hotspot. So turn on the data on your phone and then turn on the hotspot on your phone and then you can go to the Wi-Fi and connect to your phone network. Once you're connected to the phone network, now you can check. Next step is to run these command. These commands are provided in the video description. Type in CMD in Windows search box, make a right click on command prompt app and then make sure that you open command prompt as an administrator. Click on yes to allow. Copy all these commands one by one. Paste it over here, hit the enter key. Now copy the second command, paste it, hit the enter key. So run all the commands one by one. Now once this, this is done, now restart your computer. And after the system restart, you can launch the game and then check. Still not working, the next step is to use VPN. So if you have the VPN installed in your computer, you can, uh, first of all, you can turn on the VPN and then check if that does not work, you can turn off the VPN and then check. Now the next step is to try Google DNS server. Now for this, type in control panel in Windows search box, click on control panel, go to network and internet, and then go to network and sharing center. Now click on your Wi-Fi over here and then go to properties and then select internet protocol version 4 TCP IPv4. Select it and then click on properties. Now select use the following DNS server addresses. For preferred DNS server type in 8888 and then for alternate DNS server type in 8844 and then click on validate settings upon exit and then click on OK. Close this. Now you can launch the game and then you can check. Still not working. Then uncheck IPv6 uh, from the, now for this again you have to open control panel and then you can go to, uh, click on your Wi-Fi icon over here, uh, Wi-Fi and then select properties. And over here you can see internet protocol version 6 TCP TCP IPv6. You have to uncheck this box and then click on OK and then launch the game once again and then check. You can put a check on the box uh, once you're done playing the game. Once you're done playing the game, you can go to properties and then you can again put a check over here. Click on OK and then check. Still not working. The next step is to use Ethernet connection. So if your computer has an Ethernet port and if you have an Ethernet cable, you can use the wired connection and then check. Next step is to make sure date, time, time zone and reason is correct on your computer. So at the bottom right here, you can see the date and time. Make a right click on date and time. Click on adjust date and time and make sure set time zone automatically. If this is off, turn it on. Also set time automatically. If this is off, turn it on. And then you have to click on sync now. Sync now is important. If you receive any kind of error in red color, click on sync now multiple times. And once the sync is done over here, once you have a tick mark over here, now go back to time and language and then language in region and make sure your country is selected over here. Now you can check. Still not working, restart Steam. So you can go to Steam, exit Steam, and then you can type in Steam in the Windows search box and then make a right click on Steam and then click on run as administrator and then you can check. Still not working. Next step is to update Steam. Now for this, you can go to Steam, click on Steam, click on check Steam client for update. Once done, check. Still not working. Uh, run game as an administrator. Now for this, you can make a right click on the game, manage browse local files, and then make a right click on the game exe file, and then click on run as administrator, and then you can check. 
the last step is to verify the game. next step is to verify the game files now for this you can make a right click on the game select properties go to install files tab and then click on verify integrity of game files once done once this is 100% complete now you can launch the game last step is to update your windows so go to windows update or update in security click on check for update once all the updates are installed over here restart your computer and then check so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix this error so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel